hello friends welcome back to center for civil engineers in this video i am going to show you how to perform workability tests on self compacting concrete it is also called self leveling concrete and self consolidating concrete before showing workability tests on self compacting concrete i want to highlight important points about scc it is a mixer of cement fine aggregate coarse aggregate water fly ash super plasticizer and viscosity modifying agent SCC was developed in 1986 by Professor Okamura at Kochi University, Japan. At a time when skilled labor was in limited supply, causing difficulties in concrete-related industries. To make SCC, we have to follow FNR guidelines. FNR full form is European Federation of National Associations representing for concrete. The requirements of self-competitive concrete. are achieved by properties in its fresh state the three main properties of scc are filling ability passing ability and segregation resistant to test filling ability we have to perform slum flow test and t50 cm slum flow and to verify passing ability you we have to perform l box test j ring test and also u box test and coming to third one to test segregation resistance we have to perform v funnel test at time t5 minutes this video would be very useful and informative for those who are carrying out their btech and mtech projects i am sure from this video you would learn all workability tests to be performed in making self compacting concrete so why late let's get into the video Here you can see pan mixer of capacity 80 liters. In this mixer, we have mixed all ingredients of SCC. See how the mixer is. Now here you can see inside of the concrete how the uniform color, grey color, all ingredients are mixed properly. After getting uniform mix, you can take it, and then we are going to test the properties. like passing ability filling ability and segregation resistant now mixing of concrete completed now it is ready to unload the concrete okay we can collect from uh, pan to this bowls or uh, plastic baskets then now we can test by using this mixed concrete see how the flow is available how the consistency now we can see how to perform slum flow that is flow table test using slum cone or abrams cone we have to fill this abrams cone completely from bottom to top using scoops or you can use any um, devices to fill this mold after filling mold we have to level it off after leveling we have to lift after lifting we can observe how the concrete is flowing now in this test what we are going to observe is we are going to measure the time to reach that yellow color outer line the yellow color line diameter is 50 cm that is 500 mm okay we are going to measure time to flow and time to reach this yellow color dia of 500 mm now you can see the flow of concrete whenever it reaches yellow color then we have to stop the watch stop watch now also after settling down we have to measure uh, this dia complete dia in two directions two directions uh, it has its own limits i have mentioned here in this uh, sheet you can in this slide you can see the complete details of uh, permissible limits that means what is what will be the minimum what will be the maximum whenever all those values within the minimum and maximum values then only we can call this concrete is a self compacting concrete now coming to another test l box test uh, this is the l box test uh, you can see uh, they are going to lift the door now you can see how to 
how the concrete is going passing see there are three bars are provided at the junction of this box when reinforcement bars are there how the concrete is going to flow here we are going to measure h1 and h2 height h1 nothing but it, uh, near the boxes box of uh, reinforcing bars and h2 nothing but other side opposite side take the scale and measure the height one that is h1 and h2 the ratio between h1 and h2 should be 0.8 to 1 okay the value should be 0.8 to 0.1 then only the this test will be passed otherwise we have to adjust the proportions and then you have to use we have to repeat the test until it passes until your limits are within the permissible limits now this is called j ring test j ring test so j ring nothing but whenever uh, you want to test when reinforcing bars are provided how the concrete is going to flow here you can see uh, 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 about uh, after this plastoma of cone there is a reinforcing bar cage is provided vertical members are provided okay it is like reinforcement bars obstruction now you can see how the concrete is flowing when reinforcing reinforcement bars are provided uh, here we have to measure the height height at center of the member reinforcing bars okay after measuring height this height also should be within the permissible limit then another test is v funnel test v funnel test and using this test we can study the property of segregation resistance in this test also we are going to measure the time to empty the v funnel see now you can observe the concrete emptied completely from top to bottom this time also should be within the permissible limit uh, this test is performed two times first is just v funnel test then another test is v funnel at 5 minutes that means after filling the v funnel cone we have to wait for 5 minutes then we have to open the door then we have to measure the time how much time it is going to take to empty the complete cone likewise you can measure uh, the v funnel at 5 minutes uh, see now 5 minutes completed now uh, they are going to open the door we can observe how much time it is going to take okay this time also we have to observe uh, it is also provided with the uh, limitations minimum value and maximum value when the concrete gets within the permissible limits we can say that concrete is self combat concrete if we have any doubts regarding all these tests you can ask in comment section thank you if you like this video like share your valuable comments and for more updates subscribe to my channel and tap our bell icon and choose all option in description i have given links of your favorite social media networks like facebook instagram twitter and linkedin